You shall not commit adultery. So adultery means that we have all these deficiencies before us that we, that we can fulfill. Each one of us in our spiritual work, we reveal when we enter spiritual levels that there's all these desires that specifically we can fulfill with love and bestowal. Those desires are called wife. Again, it's got nothing to do with the wife in this world. Uh, it's, to do, it's to do with uh, these specifically this field of desires that we can work with and, and fulfill. Anything outside of that field, if we go to try to fulfill it, we mightn't have the right amount of intention or ability to rise above the ego to, to fulfill that. So when we do that, it comes again into our, into our egoism. So you can already kind of see parallels here with adultery in this world, but it, again, it has nothing to do with what we're talking about spiritually, because here we're talking about the growth of the spiritual desire and how we keep that desire growing. So it means that we focus specifically on these desires that we can fulfill, and meaning sp fo focus specifically on these desires that we, can, uh, that we can bestow to, and other desires that appear to us that we mightn't be able to bestow to, so we put a restriction on them and, and we don't serve them for the time being because we know that we can't relate to those desires in a manner of bestowal and love. That's you shall not commit adultery. <laughs>